Can I stack Hello. it? <laughs> sure. Anyway, hi. <laughs> this is Professor Nia, mm. and okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, um. Hello. This is Professor Misconduct and Nia, who actually hi. should be the professor here because um Maybe. she just taught me a few little tricks, and uh, there's a few other things that we haven't showed you yet for uh, the whole copy paste and whatnot. Um, <laughs> First thing I left out. <laughs> the first Sorry. Thing I, first thing I left you. You're spoiling it. <laughs> Spoilers. First thing I left out before is one of the more basic ones, and for that I apologize. Known mm -hmm. as cut. Now anyone that has ever done anything on the web or with a notepad ever knows the difference between copy and cut. But we'll give you a quick example. Um, say I don't like these blocks here. I select each corner. Or I guess she's going to do it. All right. Oh, no, I'm doing my own thing. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing? So, I, instead of copying it, I just cut it. Oh, it's, gone. it's gone. Oh, yep. my God. It's gone, and it's copied to my clipboard. So I can come mm. over here and paste it and put it awesome. somewhere new. So that's, so uh, that's pretty much like your basic, you know. Um, that's slash slash cut, in case you didn't already figure that out. Yeah. It's just like any editing program or, you know, document program. You can either copy something and paste it or you can cut it and paste it. It's kind of the same idea. Now, Nia is going to show you some really cool stuff. And I guess I'm going to be the uh, exampler because okay. she gets to be the professor now. So. Well, you see, I've built this amazing house right here. You know, this it's really cool. Really great. Um, I can see why you wouldn't want to rebuild the whole thing. Exactly. You know, and the sad thing is, I, you know, it's in the middle of the desert. I, I need, I want to be a little closer to the sand dune so I don't have to walk so far. I can understand um, that. I want to move it, I don't know, maybe five blocks closer to these dunes over here. But I don't want to have to tear it down and rebuild it. You know, it's just so annoying. Too much work. So we're going to go ahead and copy it like you would any cube. So I've selected corner. each corner, as you saw. Perfect. So I'm going to stand in the doorway here and just copy. Okay. You're going to copy it. Now, anytime you want to move anything, it's always going to be slash slash move. What comes after depends on where you're attempting to move it. Keep in mind you can move it up or down. You'll do slash slash move the number and up or down. But right now we're trying to move it to the right. Five blocks. And it goes by direction. You can't just put right. So, which direction is north, Miss Conduct? Um, I believe that is the way that the clouds are moving. Mm, yeah. Good so, point. As you so, can see, they're going in that direction. And that's the direction I want to move my house. Wow, what a coincidence. So, so I guess what I'm saying is I want to move my house four or five north. Five blocks to the north. Mm -hmm. So you want to so. do slash slash move. Space five, space north. Oh, look Aww. at that. And now, and now we have our house where we exactly. wanted it. Conveniently close to the dune. As you can see, this marker here, I placed mm -hmm. it six blocks out, and the house moved exactly five. Yep. Now, let's say now, um, we want to, let's do move up. Yeah, let's see here. I'm, uh, I built a sign on my house. It has my name on it, obviously. I mean, as you can clearly see. Yes. But the problem is when I stand in front of my house, I can't, I can't, ugh, I can't see it, you know? Too, so I want to put the sign up floating higher in the air. So what so, we're going to do is copy it. Get the two corners, copy it to your clipboard. Okay, copy. Okay. And then the same general idea, slash, slash, move. The number of how many you want to go up. So let's do eh, five. Five. And then up. Oh! oh I can read my name! Yay, look, no matter how close you are. I know. Aww, it's see? amazing. You can also do that with down, north, south, east, and west. Same general idea. Now, one of my faves that I have known forever, I did not just find this out yesterday and play with it, um, is you can select a region. I just selected my house. I just moved them down, but um, oh. I'm not really sure what happened. They're still up there, and um, 
Oh, that's all right. Don't worry about oh, it. Oh, you that's... know what? It's because I moved it up, and there's now a blank area. Keep that in mind, guys. The area that you had last selected will always stay selected. Mm. Even if it's... your clipboard, what was on your clipboard is moved, there's now nothing but air there. So when I moved and... it down, it moved air down. Yeah, and keep in mind, I mean, you can really severely screw things up, but at the same time, simple things like that, don't freak out if you mess something up. This may take some practice. You can always undo. Um, Here's a pro tip. If you ever think you just did something really bad, like filled 100 <laughs> blocks full of lava, and you're mm -hmm. lagging, just spam undo until you disconnect. Mm -hmm. And you'll have a, a fairly good chance of coming back to your server very laggy but undamaged. Now, very, very good. that's no promise because sometimes the lava will flow and you'll undo it and the lava that flowed away is mm -hmm. still everywhere. But the faster you undo yes. the better. So as soon as you feel lag and you start to get that sinking feeling, you spam undo that undo. Immediately. <laughs> exactly. I do not say this out of experience. <laughs> <laughs> not at all. We're experts always have been. Um mm -hmm. so now that I've built my utopia in the desert, um I think we it's time we move on from a village to a full blown city. I'm gonna copy my house because I don't want this quaint little house anymore. Um, I've selected the two corners. I've copied them. I want a skyscraper. That's what I want. So after I've copied it, I'm going to do slash slash stack the number. Let's do uh, 10, and I want it to go up. I have Aww. a skyscraper. Look at and it's that, the most guys. amazing looking thing I've ever seen Check in my life. That out. Mm. Yep. That's, That's a skyscraper. Right. To the top so, of the world. Mm -hmm. and Again, keep in mind slash slash stack how many you want to Nothing. stack mm -hmm. right and then that's it and, and you can the direction if, if I'm not mistaken you can also stack left and right I've never personally done it because I've never had anything I've needed to stack left or right but well, let's try it let's stack it north oh, now let's stack the whole thing north here we go guys Oh no. It should be very interesting <laughs> if my crappy little computer server um, here decides mm -hmm. to lag Yes. You can uh, you can laugh at us, and we'll be okay with that. So we're going to mm -hmm. copy this, mm -hmm. and we're going to do slash slash stack. We're going to do five of them, and we're going to do it north. Oh, oh yeah! <laughs> now it's a mega skyscraper. Oh, you guys right. see that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now this is going to help you build those major structures you've been wanting to do, but you know weren't really sure how to use world edit, so didn't bother. You are now officially getting towards being pro status. And I uh, can build a giant skyscraper, you know? So, <laughs> yeah, well, good easy stuff. Easy peasy. And uh, we'll catch you on the next episode of our World Edit Tour. Um, mm -hmm. We're going to be teaching a little bit more complex things going forward, most likely. So, um, But this should be just about the, the majority of the basics, I would say, as far as copy and paste goes. Mm -hmm. um, usually when we're doing these, we already have decided what we're going to talk about, and then we remember something, and we add it in, which is why <laughs> Cut was like, videos in, and we're sorry. Yeah. But uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.